A simple reaction takes place in a single step. Simple reactions are known as elementary reactions. So one step reactions are called as elementary reactions. In some reactions many side reactions occur along with the main reactions involving the product formation. In some reactions many side reactions occur with the main reactions involving the product formation. Reactions which do not take place in a single step but takes place in a sequence of a number of elementary steps are called as complex reactions. So for the reactions uh, there are two major things one is called a simple reaction the other one is a complex reaction. A simple reaction will have a very normal reactance and the product is really simple. But whereas if you think about the complex reaction it will the complex reaction will create a more complex sub reactions. In turn those things will create much more complex reactions it will go on. So this is how a complex reaction will create a much more minor complex reactions. Here is the difference between the simple and the complex reaction. Occurs in a single step, occurs in a multiple steps. Overall order values are really small. Total and pseudo order value lie between 0, 1, 2 and 3. The overall order values are large and greater than 3.0. Sometimes a fractional order such as 1 by 2, 1 by 3 and 3 by 2 etc will happen. There is no side reaction in this case. Here many side reactions are present. So the products are formed directly from the reactants. Here in some complex reaction products are not formed in steps directly involving the reactants. The experimental rate constant values agree with the calculated values. Over here the experimental overall rate constant values differ from the calculated values. The theories of reaction rates apply well on simple reaction. Over here it do not agree 